Hello everyone, welcome to my new video. Today, we're going to look at the top 5 natural wonders that, unfortunately, we'll never see with our own eyes again, either thanks to human intervention or due to natural disasters. In nature, you can find countless interesting and beautiful places or formations that were created for over millions of years so we could enjoy them. Hundreds of thousands of people visit such places every year. But iconic places like these can be seen again only painted on canvas, photographed, or in various films and series until they completely disappeared. So sit back and let's get started. Fifth place, Chakaltea Glacier. It is believed that even before the Chakaltea Glacier completely melted and disappeared from the Earth's surface, it was about 18,000 years old. This glacier that was located near the city Lapas, Bolivia, was once a popular ski resort, and even this resort was the highest ski resort in the world, at an altitude of 5,421 meters. The melting of the glaciers due to climate change was predicted in the 1990s for the year 2015, but it happened much sooner than anyone expected. The last pieces of snow and ice disappeared already in 2009, and Bolivia thus lost a beautiful natural monument and a wonderful skiing area. According to forecasts, almost all the glaciers in the Andes should do the same. Fourth place, Tree in Tenera. The tree in Tenera was a lone acacia that grew in the middle of the Tenera Desert in northern Niger. It was labeled as the loneliest tree in the world, when the nearest tree was 400 kilometers away from it. For the caravans, the acacia tree was a very important landmark, and the indigenous Tuaregs even revered it as sacred. Its age was estimated at 300 years in 1938, and it managed to survive only thanks to extremely deep roots that drew water from a nearby well. Unfortunately, in 1973, the tree in Tenera was destroyed by a truck driver, who apparently carelessly drove off the road. The remains of the tree were then transported to the National Museum in Niamey, and a metal replica of the tree by an unknown artist was created as a souvenir at that place. Third place, Arrow Lake. The Arrow Lake was once so large that it was nicknamed the Arrow Sea. Carps, sturgeons, roaches and roach lived in it, and today, together with Chernobyl, it is taken as a synonym for an ecological disaster of enormous proportions. The receding of the lake and its massive pollution completely destroyed the once rich fishing industry, and in addition led to the creation and expansion of salt deserts and swamps in the vicinity. This is what a 1997 satellite image of the Aral Sea looked like, and this is 24 years later. Today, all that is left of the lake is its torso with the ships in the middle of the desert. However, nature is not to blame for its destruction, as with the other points in today's video, but man. This radical change is the result of a monstrous project to irrigate the desert for the purpose of growing cotton, and at the same time pollution of tributaries with fertilizers and pesticides. Second place, Pioneer Cabin Tree. California's Calaveras Big Tree State Park has been a popular tourist attraction since 1852, mainly because of its giant sequoias. One of these iconic trees was a tree called Pioneer Cabin. In 1857, it was found to be largely hollow, so loggers cut a hole in it for hikers to walk through. At one time it was even made available to the passage of cars. However, again in 2017, the park was hit by the strongest storms in the last 10 years, which caused it to overturn and subsequently break in half. The most likely cause of the fall was probably not very bare roots that could not withstand the onslaught of water. This thousand-year-old sequoia is thus another natural monument that, unfortunately, we will never see with our own eyes again. First place, Azure Window. The Azure Window was this magnificent rock formation located on the west coast of Malta's second largest island, Gozo. Tens of thousands of tourists went to it every year and was among Malta's greatest natural attractions. Rock Arch has even starred in several successful films, such as in 1981's Clash of the Titans, or more recently in the series Game of Thrones. However, due to erosion and frequent storms in 2017, the arch could not withstand the onslaught and collapsed into the water. According to geologists, it was only a matter of time before this happened. Tourists were even forbidden to walk on the arch, under the threat of a fine of 1,500 euros. 
Still, they used to go there. At the time of the collapse luckily no one was hurt. Today's video is slowly coming to an end and I'm glad you stayed here with me. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and click on the bell so you don't miss anything you might like. Also don't forget to write in the comments which natural wonder you like the most. For now I'm saying goodbye to you and I'm looking forward to the new video.